Hello, Synapse community. My name is Ryan Majidimer, and I'm a product manager on the Azure Synapse Analytics team. It's officially summer in the Pacific Northwest, and today we're here for the July edition of the Azure Synapse Monthly Update. We've got a lot of exciting updates for you today. We've got updates for Apache Spark for Synapse, Data Explorer, Data Integration, as well as some updates for the developer experience and Synapse Link. You can find all of the information that I'm going to talk about today, as well as more descriptions of each feature, links to documentation, all sorts of fun stuff in the blog post for the monthly update. You can find the link for that in the description for this video. First, let's talk about the Synapse Notebook experience. As you know, the official kernel for Jupyter Notebooks is IPython, and previously it was not supported by Synapse Notebooks. I'm happy to announce that IPython is now fully supported with Synapse Notebooks. When running PySpark notebooks, IPython will be used as the default Python interpreter. In this release, we added dozens of new built-in magic commands. We also made the debug experience better with inline error highlight. Here's what the debug looked like before, and this is what it looks like now. In addition to that, the auto-completion experience has been improved. Let's switch gears to Synapse Data Explorer. You may or may not be aware that Data Explorer is a fast and highly scalable data exploration service for log and telemetry data. You can use data from event hubs, IoT data, data in blob storage, or Azure Stream Analytics. And that is actually what our next feature is about. And it's a preview feature for data integration with Azure Stream Analytics and Data Explorer. Azure Stream Analytics is a real-time analytics service and an event processing engine designed to analyze and process high volumes of fast streaming data from multiple sources simultaneously. An Azure Stream Analytics job consists of an input source, a transformation query, and an output connection. There are several output types to which you can send transformed data. You can create, edit, and test Stream Analytics jobs using the Azure portal, Azure Resource Manager, or ARM templates, Azure PowerShell, the .NET API, there's a REST API, and Visual Studio. You can now use a Stream Analytics job to collect data from an event hub and send it to your Azure Data Explorer cluster using the Azure portal or an ARM template. And those are the features for this month. Again, my name is Ryan Majidimer. You can find me on Twitter. You can also find Azure Synapse on Twitter. Azure underscore Synapse. You can also become an Azure Synapse influencer. It's very fun. We're all doing it. All of the cool kids are doing that. I might not be a cool kid, but there's there's cool people doing it. They're out there. They're, they're part of the club. And don't you want to be in the club with all of the cool kids? Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.